everyone, it's Kristen Linnae. I am finally back. I know, it's been forever since I did a video that wasn't just a Patreon teaser. I'm sorry. I want to try to do more videos. As you can see, look at my cool ass setup. Like, isn't it badass? So today's video is a sponsored video by this awesome company called Fans Made. I'll put the links in the description if you want to check it out. They sponsor me a bunch of merch and basically they specialize in like anime, comic, movies, gaming, merch, all kinds of really cool stuff. I saw so many things on the site that I wanted. It was really hard just to choose a handful of things but luckily they were nice enough to send me a big old package of why does Pikachu keep falling down? Dang it! Stay Pikachu! Please stay. Please. Please. There's so many plushies. Ah. Anyway, fans made let me go through the whole site and pick out a handful of things that I can review and try on for you guys and show off. So, super excited. I have the bag right here. And so I guess let's just dig right into it. I picked out about six items, I think. Um... I, I tried to pick a little bit of everything, but I think I chose more hoodies uh, than some of the other things. So the first item I'm seeing here, oh, I'm so excited about this one. Um, this is a Luke Cage, Luke Cage hoodie, and take a look at the logo. It's it's kind of like an imitation of the Starbucks logo, and it says, "Let's get some coffee." Luke's famous little line which means let's bang basically. I think these were unisex sizing so I must have got like a small or extra small. Yep it's a small and it still looks pretty big but that's to be expected with unisex sizing especially for me. I'm pretty petite besides like the boob area but anyway let me put this on real quick and let's see what it looks like. Alright, and here is the Let's Get Some Coffee hoodie. Oh my god, I'm living for this hoodie. I love it so much. The fit, the fit is actually really, really great. And another thing I'm noticing, I don't know if you guys can see, but this one is actually, this hoodie is actually not plain black either. If you look closely, there's this little like speckled pattern happening here which is actually really really nice. I think it sets it apart and doesn't make it look so like oh I went online and I just printed like a plain hoodie you know like it's actually really adds to the design and makes it look higher quality and nicer and oh my god I'm living for these. I'm living for these. Let's check out the next item. Super excited. Ooh, I think this is one of the dresses that I picked out and it's actually like a hoodie dress which is really cool because I've really been into that whole style of wearing an oversized hoodie as a dress with like some either thigh-high stockings or thigh-high boots or something. It's totally like Ariana Grande influenced. I think this is it. I mean, I'm pretty sure it said it was a dress. It seems kind of short just looking at it right now, but I think it will totally be fine. I picked out the Captain Marvel design. Super stylish. Take a look. I'm gonna try it on real quick. Let's see what it looks like. Ooh, so here we are with the hoodie dress, Captain Marvel. Oh my god, I am so happy I decided to get this one. I was actually going to get another like Spider-Man design and I'm like, yo, I need to venture out and get some variety here. So I got Captain Marvel and I'm so glad I did. It looks so good. Look at that. So cute. And now I have something that I can wear to the Captain Marvel movie premiere. They're, they're fitted very nice and they just have... Just a little bit of looseness like a hoodie would. Um, we got the pockets. Very, very nice. I like this a lot. Uh, what do we have next? Oh, another Luke Cage item. I know. I, I try to pick um, from different like series and fandoms and stuff, but when it came to the Luke Cage stuff, I just couldn't help myself because I really love Luke Cage so much and I. I know that now that it's cancelled, you're probably going to stop seeing as much merch for Luke Cage, so I think that's why I really wanted to get 
a couple Luke Cage items because it might be the last chance to ever get any. So for the Luke Cage, I got another hoodie, which is kind of cool because hoodies, just like black hoodies are kind of like his main thing that he wears in the show. So here's this one. This is a Luke Cage busting through, I think, a wall. And it says, sweet Christmas. Oh wait, you can't see it. I'm sorry. Let me show it like this. It says sweet Christmas and also I just noticed this I didn't even notice on the website but he's got the swear jar um, busting out next to him which is really cool and this definitely looks more like comic booky this drawing of him and I just really love it I love Luke Cage so much this isn't just plain black hoodie it's actually I wouldn't call it camouflage uh, print or pattern, but it's kind of like, I don't know, it's kind of like a, a paint splatter, like splotchy look, which is really, really cool. Actually, I really like it. I like that it's not just plain black. So let's try this one on. Just over the moon about this logo on this one. It is so good. I love it so much. And I, I really, really love um, that there is a pattern. It's not just plain black. I didn't notice that on the site. So epic. I think it adds so much more to this hoodie than if it was just a plain black color. So major thumbs up for this one. It looks like another... Oh, so I guess I got two regular hoodies and two hoodie dresses. I was really excited about the hoodie stuff. I'm sorry. It's got the I believe this is like the iron spider. It looks like the iron spider. Very cool. Check it out. Again, the print is very, very nice. I really like it. Um, yeah, just another hoodie dress. Let me try it on real quick and let's see what we think about this one. I'm going to try to stand back so we can see. It's a very nice length, I will say. I was a little worried about these, to be honest. And I like that it actually does have the front like hoodie type pocket. So it's, it's just like right under my bum. So I definitely would have to be very, very careful if I bent over because that would definitely expose the bottom. Um, the print looks good, feels good. I like the lightweight material for hoodie dress like I mentioned um, just a minute ago. And yeah, really like this one. Alright, so what are the last two items? I know, I'm sorry. It's been like a few weeks since I picked out this stuff, so I mean I definitely remembered the Luke Cage stuff, but I honestly kind of forgot some of the other things that I ordered. Alright, so the first pair of leggings. Oh my god, this is so epic. These are Detroit Become Human Kara um, Android leggings. If you play that game, um, Kara is one of the main characters, and this is she has like a dress, like this, um, this whole design is a dress, but this is on leggings, which is really awesome. The butt says Android. Very cool. I like it. No, I've said this a lot of times, but I actually plan on going to the gym again very soon. So I'm going to need some nice leggings to work out in and these will be it. All right. And here are the Detroit Become Human Cara leggings. Oh my god, I, I just can't get over like how nice these feel. Like they just fit my body perfect in every every aspect. Which is really hard for me by the way. Pants are the hardest thing for me to shop for because I just have weird proportions. Like my hips are kind of bigger for my body frame. But then I have like these little bitty chicken legs. <laughs> but these actually fit me so well. I love that booty logo detail there. That is so cool. Definitely kind of um, brings a little attention to your booty, which may be a good or a bad thing. Not much more to say about these. I just love them a lot. All right, the very, very last item right here is another pair of leggings. Oh, there's actually something inside the leggings. And how cool that I opened this one last. Let's see what this is. I didn't order this. This must be like a little freebie gift that you get or something. It looks like, oh my god, no way. 
It's a Groot from Guardians of the Galaxy keychain, but um, just take a look at what he's doing. <laughs> I need to show you guys. He is actually like flipping the bird. He's totally flipping the bird right now. First I'm like, oh, it's just a cute little Groot keychain. Okay. No. He's like totally flipping the bird and that's epic. I'm gonna go put this on my key ring as soon as I finish this video. But back to the last item that I was about to show off. Another pair of leggings. I think this might be my favorite. Oh my god, I didn't even notice all these details. So, first off, let me just show you. These are Fallout 76 leggings. Funny enough, um, I picked these out before the game came out, by the way. I know, the game's not been great so far. Hopefully, with a few patches down the road, maybe it'll get better. Maybe they'll listen to some feedback. But either way, I'm a huge Fallout fan. I love Fallout so much. I, I don't, I'm kind of embarrassed to even look at how many hours I've put into that series. So I chose these really cute Fallout leggings. On the front they say 76, Vault 76. And then the detail that I didn't even notice when I picked these is that it's got like printed on gun holsters and a gun. And then this side on the leg has a holster and then a bottle of Nuka-Cola Quantum in the holster which is pretty rad. I like the bottoms of the legs. They have like um, printed on like armor. It looks like you know the leather armor that the basic vault suit outfit usually has. So yeah, let's try these on real quick. Material, it seems like it breathes really well. Like I don't feel too hot and stuffy in these so I think they would be good to work out in. Here's the back. I love the gun holster detail like I mentioned before. I think that's really cool. I didn't even see that to be honest when I picked them. And then here's the back. It says Fallout. Do do do. So yeah, I love these so much. I actually kind of wish now that I picked another pair of leggings because these are so comfortable and I can see myself wearing these all the time. Anyways, that concludes our little fans made try on haul video. I hope you guys liked it. And I want to give a major, major thank you to our sponsor fans made for sending me all these items for review. Thank you so much. I loved them all so much and I can't wait to go wear them. I'm going to be wearing them like every day for the next few weeks. I'm so excited. Again, if you want to go to Fans Made and check out all the rest of the stuff that they have, I'll leave the link in the description. I will say they have so much stuff. Like when I went to go choose my items, there were like hundreds of pages and items. I was just scrolling forever and it took me like hours to decide what to get. So I just know you guys will love this stuff. They have something for everyone, whether it be anime lovers, video games, lots and lots of comic stuff, Marvel comics, there are tons of Marvel comic stuff, video games, just anything you can think of, they have it. So go check them out and I hope you guys like this video. I will see you next time. Bye!